Hello and welcome to the YouTube version of Draw Monkey. It is a show that I uh, do on Instagram Live every other Friday or whenever I have time. I'm trying to keep a better schedule about it. But on this week's episode, I'm at a coffee shop with my friend Irene. I do an inking demo uh, using two pens, but mostly one because this one didn't work. But uh, I ink with the Pilot Parallel Pen. Um, this one has a 2.4 millimeter uh, nib, okay? And um, the other pen I tried to use, but maybe I'll do another demo with some other time. Uh, it, the ink took a while to flow through the pen, so I wasn't able to use it uh, right away like this one. Um, but this was the Pilot Kakuno pen. It's got like a calligraphy or a fountain pen nib. Anyways, um, so I show you how to refill both cartridges and I do an inking demo with this one and uh, talk about the importance of learning how to draw hands. Oh, I show you some cool splatter techniques I can do with this and talk about my favorite Ninja Turtle villain briefly. So enjoy all that and more on this week's episode of Draw Monkey. Peace. Someone said Team NT. I am always down to draw some Ninja Turtles. Casey Jones, this guy is winning all these suggestions today. So let's do that. these two pens here that have depleted in ink and I actually bought some ink especially for this so I'm gonna go ahead and fill these up this is a, a pilot parallel pen this will be good for like some really good lines whoops So if you ever want to make like a cool, this pen is awesome. It's uh, got a flat tip. It makes para -like, parallel lines, you know? There's the ink cartridge. It's a little runny though, but I like that because you, you can get really cool splatter effects with this. So we're going to go ahead and install that. See, it's already... Yeah, and let that, did I do that right? Yeah, let that settle in. Oh, it's like a calligraphy pen. It is, it's yeah. Really and you can get these in different sizes. So that's that pen. So this will, this will get messy. And then I have this pen. This is a Pilot uh, Kakuno pen. It's like a fountain tip. This pen is really awesome for lines, really thin lines. And here's the ink cartridges for those. You get live action demo right here. I'm sure our waitress is like, this is great. Can you pay the bill and leave? To which I say, no, ma'am. All right, and get out of here. <laughs> Okay, so there's that. I'm gonna I'm gonna start with this. This this uh, reacts to um, the cardboard a little differently because it uh, it almost scratches it. And I'm gonna go ahead and try and ink this. Oh wait, isn't that working? And fail. <laughs> I'll use this. This is probably like oozing. This is a really good way to like s sort of soak your drawing up a bit. This one bleeds a little on the uh, cardboard. But look, look at the kind of varied line you can get. You can go really thin and then you can just go super, 
super wide and dark. And this is a fun pen to play with. I really am just, uh, what's the word? Uh, Re-familiarizing myself with this. Who's my favorite Turtles villain? Oh man, that's a good question. I'm gonna go with the Rat King. I like the Rat King. Okay, I'm gonna come in here and sort of refine some of these. If you're okay with like this pen bleeding on this kind of paper, you know, you can use it to your advantage. Hands are some of the most difficult things to draw. Um, you know, I feel like you need to, you, you constantly need to brush up on your, on drawing hands if you're an artist, just cause they are very difficult and uh, it's good to constantly practice with drawing different hands. Can't be afraid to get your hands dirty when you work with a pen like this. It's a little messy, but it's fun to play with. So again, this was the um, the Pilot Parallel Pen. I forget the nib. It's a uh, 2.4. And uh, you could get the ink refills, and that's these ones. If you're interested. And uh, the other thing I used was my Pilot G2. This is a ballpoint pen. My white ink pen, the Jelly Roll. Cool. Not I need to make a new one of these that says, there you go. <laughs> See ya.